I love football. I love scoring touchdowns. I love tackling guys. I love walking out on the field hand in hand with my teammates. I love the crowd, hearing them scream throughout the course of the game. I never knew that such a simple act could have such a great impact on the community. I'm Peter McCudden. I've, I play at Waukesha West High School. I've been playing football since fourth grade. I've been going to Elmbrook ever since. I can remember my parents have been going here for a long time, and I've been privileged to have the opportunity to lead the prayer after every single football game since I was a sophomore through my senior year. It started um, with my brother, Kevin, then it was passed on to my brother, Thomas. Soon after that, the captains from the prior year and our head coach kind of pulled me aside and they said they really wanted me to carry on the tradition that my brothers has started. And to say that I've done it with my brothers and it's been passed down makes it even cooler. You know, Waukesha West, is a, it's a public school, so being able to have that prayer be a part of the tradition that we do after every game, it's a really cool challenge to be a part of. My senior year of football, our football team went 12-0, and we were entering the state semifinal in football. And we were up against the Brookfield Central team, and they were a great football team. They were also undefeated. At the end of the game, we came up short. Uh, it was a tough loss, very emotional, just because it's one step short of uh, the state championship at Camp Randall. Being on varsity for four years and uh, going to the state championship my freshman and sophomore year and losing both times, and then coming up so close in my senior year. You know, obviously it would've been great to be able to get a gold ball at the end and win that championship. I knew after a loss like that, it was time to kind of pull it all together and this is my senior year, it's the end of my career at Waukesha West, but how am I gonna leave the, the legacy of how we do things at Waukesha West and just in our community? Soon after, I went and approached a guy named Zach Heckman. He actually goes to Elmbrook and just asked him if he'd like to join us for a prayer. It was tough to gather the words, but the Lord spoke through me. Having another team that you just went to war with for a couple hours and just having that moment to give thanks, it's a really cool opportunity. It was a picture that was taken when I was standing over everybody and just giving thanks to God for everything that he's done for us and giving us the opportunity to play. And I didn't know it was taken. I didn't ask for it to be taken. You know, it kind of caught fire on Twitter, and you know, I never, never would ask for it, but the fact that it was noticed is pretty cool, just being able to show that it's more than just a game, and being able to leave the legacy and kind of have a positive impact as I finish up my high school career. There's been a lot of great football moments in my career, but being able to take part in that has been something that I'll never forget.